Hi, my name is Ng Kaila from Song Kyung Kwan University and I will be presenting about my research which is ion transporting channel M morph in cough as composite solid electrolytes with enhanced electrochemical properties. This is the order of my presentation today. Lithium ion batteries are a promising technology for overcoming energy depletion and their use is likely to continue to grow as the world seeks more sustainable and efficient sources of energy. However, safety issue is one of the major obstacles to the widespread and economically viable use of LIB, particularly in electrical vehicles. This is primarily attributed to the use of liquid electrolytes, which are prone to fires and explosion due to their flammability and potential thermal runway. Accordingly, studies on solid state electrolytes are being extensively developed to replace liquid electrolytes. The advantages of solid state electrolyte is that they have higher safety, higher energy density, and lower cost, which shows high potential for the future of battery. Primarily, there are two types of solid state electrolyte inorganic solid state electrolyte and polymer solid state electrolyte. Due to its rigidity and brittleness, Inorganic solid state electrolyte has poor mechanical properties despite its high ionic conductivity. In contrast, polymeric solid state electrolyte has a relatively lower ionic conductivity at room temperature despite its excellent flexibility. To date, research has spoken focused on integrating lithium ion conductive inorganic materials into polymeric materials to form composite solid state electrolyte. However, under weighted limitation in lower ionic conductivity and lithium transfer number must be addressed before the solid state electrolyte can be commercialized. Therefore, exploring new materials for composite solid state electrolyte to overcome current limitation are gaining significant attention in order to alleviate the current bottleneck. Covalent organic framework COF are a type of porous organic material being investigated for a variety of applications including gas storage and separation, catalysis, drug delivery, and energy storage devices. COF are composed of light elements such as boron, oxygen, nitrogen, and carbon that form strong, strong covalent bonds, resulting in a highly ordered crystalline structure with well-defined pores. In contrast to polymer electrolytes, which transport lithium ion via a hopping mechanism through the change, well-aligned structure in COF serves as a host and provides a one-dimensional channel for lithium-ion transport. Such structural characteristics show promise as a solid-state electrolyte for high-performance lithium-ion battery. The advantages of COF as solid-state electrolytes are first, their high porosity and crystallinity. Second, the ability to integrate various functional groups to the pore wall. Third, the tunable process. And finally, their high thermal stability. In this context, considerable effort has been devoted to the development of cough based solid state electrolyte, which is based on the periodic crystalline framework of cough and impacts advantage features of high thermal stability, programmable pore environment, and tunable pore size. Among them, one of the notable strategies is to incorporate ionic liquid into the pores of cough to create a composite material, which we call it cough. IL composite solid state electrolyte. Ionic liquid is incorporated into the pores of cough to create cough IL composite, where IL acts as a source of additional ions that can facilitate lithium ion transport through the 1D porous structure of cough. Ionic liquid is a classic of organic salts that are liquid at room temperature and possess distinctive properties such as high thermal stability low vapor pressure and good solidity for a wide range of salt. Using cough as a host, Covanic IL form a combined phase of cough IL composite that improves ionic conductivity and electro electrolyte interfacial compatibility through a wetting effect. However, the relatively large pore size of cough will cause confined IL forming Bulk structure which can impede the smooth transport of the ionic liquid and lead to leakage over time. Thus, for the use of cough IL in practical battery application, 
performance of cough IL composite materials as solicit electrolyte must be enhanced by introducing a pore modification strategy that allows the control of pore size for efficient ionic liquid transport while preventing ionic liquid leaching from the host material. Here, we chose Metal Organic Framework MOF, which is a crystalline material composed of a metal ion linked by organic ligands with ultra microporous structure as the materials for hybridization with cough to control the pore size. We propose a IL at MOF in cough for quasi solicit electrolyte. This ionic liquid laden cough with pore controlling MOF which ZIF-8 is chosen as the MOF act as a pore controller to shrink the pore size for efficient lithium ion transport. The ZIF-8 synthesized inside the pore of cough control the pore size to prevent leaching of ionic liquid from MOF in cough's host material over time. At the same time, it will increase the ionic conductivity and the lithium ion transformers number of this composite electrolyte for the application of battery. The synthesis of IL at MOF in cough structure are as below. First, we mix alnine aldehyde with p toluene sulfonic acid as the catalyst together to get a viscous slurry. Cast it on glass slide drying and after washing, drying and punching, we will get a film which is TPPA cough film with a pore size of 1.83 nanometer. Then, by two-step immersion process, we will get a self-standing ZIF-8 in cough, which ZIF-8 has a unit cell size of 1.6 nanometer, which is able to be incorporated into TPPA cough. Then, this self-standing ZIF-8 in cough is doped with ionic liquid to form a quasi-solid-state electrolyte. Next, let's look into the result of the research. First is the morphology. Well, the left side is the uh, same image and TEM image for TPPA cough, and the right side is the same image and TEM image for ZIF-8 in cough. The same images show both cough and ZIF-8 in cough have same fibrous structure. Thus, no ZIF-8 is deposited on cough is observed. Next, 10 images shows the porous structure of cough and change in density of ZIF-8 in cough, which we can know that ZIF-8 is incorporated inside cough. Well, furthermore, ZIF-8 is observed inside cough pore but not on the surface of cough. Therefore, successful synthesis of ZIF-8 in cough can be concluded. Next is the chemical properties. From this XRD data, we can observe that there is no new peak presence in ZIF-8 in cough. We can know that ZIF-8 is formed inside the pore of cough instead as a new layer on cough. The intensity of cough decreases as ZIF-8 is introduced into the pore. Next is the FDIR data. We can see from this data to confirm the successful synthesis of cough. And from the enlarged image, we can confirm that there are peaks related to ZIF-8, which is observed around 400 to 600 wave number, which we can confirm the successful, successful synthesis of ZIF-8 in cough. Next is the XPS data. We can see from the full spectra, indicate the presence of nitrogen, oxygen, and carbon in cough and an addition of zinc in ZIF-8 in cough. We can further confirm the presence of zinc from the high resolution XPS of zinc in ZIF-8 in cough and also from the carbon high resolution XPS we can see C double bond N and C double bond O form which indicates the successful synthesis of ZIF-8 in cough. Most importantly we can observe a shift in the peak from the oxygen high resolution XPS, which a new zinc oxide peak is observed inside ZIF 8 in.
you can know that this shift is happened because of zinc absorbed on the C Singapore OH site and destroyed the original cathode and the tautomerism balance in coal. And therefore, the zinc oxide is formed inside the pore and the cough shift towards the C double bond O, which is a more stable structure of cough. And from here, we can conclude that there is a successful synthesis of CIF8 in cough structure. Next is the electrochemical properties. From this, we can know that the ionic conductivity of this composite electrolyte increase over time and at 60 degrees Celsius, it can achieve a 1.74 times 10 to the power of negative 5 Siemens per centimeter conduct ionic conductivity. For the future work, we will continue to work with the electrochemical characterization, which is the ionic conductivity and lithium ion transference analysis, full cell analysis, cycle test, and also BT analysis to observe no leakage after cycle. And also, we will continue to work on IL and MOF in cough structure optimization by optimizing the condition for ionic liquid doping in order to achieve higher ionic conductivity and lithium ion transfers number. Also, optimizing the mechanical strength of film for more ideal battery application in the future. For summary, we propose an ionic liquid at MOF in cough structure for quasi solid state electrolyte. First, the cough IR composite solid state electrolyte has well ordered one dimensional channel with additional ion source IL which facilitates the lithium ion transfer. However, pore size modification is needed to prevent leakage of IR over time. So, CIF8 in cough structure is introduced for pore size control and enhanced ionic conductivity for quasi solid state electrolyte. By incorporating CIF8 inside pore of cough can shrink the pore size to prevent ionic liquid leakage and also Lewis as a site of CIF8 capture and ion which accelerate the lithium ion transport. This is all of my presentation. Thank you.